Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today my mom is going to be joining me because we're switching up the roles. So today my mom is going to be asking me questions or questions in general that moms are too afraid to ask I guess to their daughters their children or just like in general but some of them might be personal to me and then like my opinion so she's gonna start off with the first question <laughs> but before we get into the video I want to talk about the holidays coming up if you are having a really hard time trying to find the best gift for that special someone or literally anyone in general I got you guys covered chapbooks is the most modern way to hold on to your best moments and memories it's a fast and affordable easy way to get your photos off your phone and into your hands I think it's a perfect time to actually start shopping for your holiday gifts and I think a monthly subscription is the best way to go for a gift for your grandparents or even your parents. If you guys are not familiar with chapbooks, they are a monthly photo book subscription where every month you will choose 30 pictures straight from your camera roll. You're basically taking your photos straight off your phone and creating it into the book and the books are actually created through the app which is super easy to navigate. Today I'm going to be creating a hardcover and all you do is click create down below and as you can tell there is a lot of colors to choose from and I'm going to choose pink and then basically you add your photos customize your book and that's it monthly books start as little as ten dollars with free shipping so chapbooks is super affordable chapbooks is the most perfect gift for any occasion so make sure to click the link down below in the description box download the app and use the code holiday 20 to get 20 percent off the entire site first question do you hide anything on your phone then when I was younger, but not now, I don't have anything to hide and she can easily just go through. I think every teenager obviously has some, like on Snapchat, you can have like my eyes only or like you can hide uh, photos in your photo album actually. I don't have anything in it though. <laughs> Do you ever feel like some of your friendships are temporary? Well, yeah, <laughs> I mean, there's a difference between acquaintances and like me and Elizabeth's friendship. Like obviously we've been friends for nine years, so it's not temporary, but like, you know, some people it's just like school friends. I'll sit in class and talk to them, but that's not like something that's gonna actually carry on outside of high school. <clears throat> so yeah. The last time you kissed someone. Yeah, <laughs> mm. <laughs> I was gonna tell you last night, but then you did. <laughs> Last night. <laughs> okay, last night. <laughs> um, have you or your friends lost their virginity yet? I have not. My best friend Ellie has not. And that is my only friend that I can speak of. I mean, like, my guy friends, I don't really know. And that's weird if I knew that. But um, I'm sure some of them have. So I don't know. But I have not. <laughs> Do you have Snapchat? I do have Snapchat. Um, I got it like I get three three months ago, I think. What's your Snap score? I think it's like sixty thousand. I know what that means, <laughs> but I just know people talk. About. Have you been to third base yet? What's third base? Is that first? Feeling one? up. And what did you just say? <laughs> Feeling up. Yeah, like squishy, squishy. Okay, okay, okay this is. <laughs> and then third base is. <laughs> okay. I don't need sound effects. Do you want me to say it? I've been to first base, it's just kissing. <laughs> this needs to stay PG-13. <laughs> Why? You're almost 18. <laughs> um, no, I have not. Jeez. <laughs> no. <laughs> have you almost lost your virginity? Nope. My panties have never been off. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us the story of your homecoming date and what happened. Wasn't even anything serious. Um, so you know, homecoming, he moved on, as I guess I would state it and we just stopped talking. Are you on birth control? I am not on birth control. Do you plan to be on birth control? Well, I would hope so when I'm older. I don't have bad periods. I know people use it for that, <clears throat> but I don't plan on needing it anytime soon, so. Do you regret your first kiss? It was so bad. I, I'll just say, I don't think I've said it before, but in the car outside my house at like 11 o'clock and he kissed me and I said, that was bad. <laughs> Out loud. <laughs> in front of his face and and then after that he kissed me again and I was like okay whatever he must have not taken it personally but that's not what I meant and I was really nervous and it wasn't bad I think it was just my kissing was bad because I've never kissed anyone so then I texted him later and I was just like oh, that's not what I meant it was because I was whatever <laughs> so yeah <laughs> I do regret it. <laughs> Have you ever lied to your parents? I mean, yeah. Caught lying too. So, I mean, I think every teenager um, lies. I mean, my sister lies too. I think everyone lies. Ever snuck out of your house or your friend's house? I have never snuck out of... I don't usually have sleepovers. At, I mean, I do, but I've never snuck out of their house. I've never snuck out of my house. But I have this plan. I will be sneaking out once I graduate, but she'll know. 
<laughs> That's not sneaking <laughs> out. Do you plan on saving yourself for marriage? I mean, why not? I mean, if you meet someone that you date for a really long time, then it, it just depends on who you're with. And I don't really know how to answer that question because it's like, I mean, I would, but if I meet someone, then you know, who knows? <laughs> Do you think it's okay to have payback sex? So like, boyfriend cheated on you and you go have sex with someone else for payback? Well, <laughs> considering. <laughs> um, no, I'd probably just sit in my room and cry like I, I, I did. <laughs> I mean, it depends on the situation and how old you are. I wouldn't do it now, but I feel like a 25 year old would. College person in college, I think. Yeah, but I don't think I would do it because I'd be too sad. <clears throat> are you bi, straight, or lesbian? I am straight, but I support. Do you ever feel like Mark favors Ellie more? No, just because not my real dad doesn't mean I get treated differently. We both get treated the same from him because it's Mark. Do you care if a guy isn't a virgin when going into a relationship? Uh, I think you should probably know from the start, right? <laughs> Depends on their age, too. If they're like 17 and they have had t 10 partners, uh, well, yeah. I would move along. Oh well, yeah, I would. I think it just depends on, like my mom said, the age and how many, how many people they've slept with. What do you hate most about doing social media? Probably just like how negative people are. I'm and like you can never please anyone and everything that you say is either controversial or just like it doesn't make people happy. Have you ever danced with an like dirty danced with anyone? <laughs> no. Twerk, twerk, twerk. I mean I twerk with Ellie and like Elizabeth. Like what's something you regret in your life and why? Probably how lazy I am. Because I could be far more successful and prepared for You could have graduated already. Yeah. Just could have changed my motives and priorities. Do you miss your real dad? No. I haven't talked to him in five years? Six years? Five years? Oh, it'll be six years when I turn 18. Because I was 12. Yeah. What is your favorite physical feature about yourself? My eyes. I like my eyes. So funny. What? That was what every everyone would say to me when I was younger. Your eyes? Mm hmm Your eyes and eyelashes. Your That's eyes. what people... They're so big. Your eyelashes are so long. That's what I get. I don't mm -hmm. get you got big lips or anything. No. <laughs> so just know when you get old, your extra skin and eyelids is gonna hang down. Mmm, I cannot wait. Have you ever smoked weed? I have not smoked weed. Have you ever ate gummies or gummies? No. I mean, I know what jello Do people even do drug gummies here? That I know of. No. Okay, this is her last and final question of the night. I have two. The first one, is there anything in your life you wish you would have changed? So you would change your reaction. Reactions and actions, I guess, to some scenarios. Okay, last question. Do you have a boyfriend now? And if so, what's his name? I'm not dating anyone, but I guess it's like a... Um, I guess you could put it in. Her, that, that doesn't make sense to her. She, it's either you're with him or you're not with him. But it, I'm in between. Like, I'm loyal to him. Like, I'm not going to go and flirt or talk to any other guy or go out so with... So you're committed. Committed to him, but not actually dating him. What's the difference? Just how it is now. No, <laughs> I know, but I just want to know what the difference is. Well, he didn't ask, he hasn't asked me to be his girlfriend. Do people even ask? Yeah. The I wrong think. ones asked? Last one? Yeah. But I would rather not say his name, um, but I am, I guess, seeing someone. Only because the only people that know in my life are my family, Elizabeth and Ellie. That's it. No one, no one at school even knows either, so. I think private relationships are the best way to go. So anyways, guys, those are all the questions that she's going to be asking me. Like I said, it's more of like a personal Q&A, just like for questions so she gets a better understanding. I don't really know, but. So anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all very soon back with more videos. Bye, guys.